but this is the final meeting as members of the Greater Noose River Conference. This conference, in its current iteration, will no longer be around beginning next year as Clayton drops down to 3A, Garner will stay 4A, and the Comets will be in a conference with nothing but Johnston County schools like South Johnston, West Johnston, so creating that inner counter rivalry. Meanwhile, Garner joins the conference with the likes of Fuqua, Arena, Middle Creek, Holly Springs, and boy, those are going to be some wars on the gridiron next fall. It's a battle, right? No doubt. It's always fun to have those rivalries, and if you're a player on the field, that's what you look forward to. You look forward to playing against the teams that you either have that respect for, or maybe in some circumstances you don't like at all, and you have those bragging rights for a year. Lizer flushed, turns all kinds of ways, and just throws it away, looking for Roberts. We'll bring up another third down for the Comets. It will certainly be a lot of fun, and I think this is a Clayton team, Jay, that is going to benefit, a program that's going to benefit from going back to 3A, not having to play teams that have twice their own. I think they're going to dominate when they go to 3A, but this year, right now, they're having an excellent season. 6-1 I mean, is not bad. 6-1 and one on new coach, Coach Jinx. I love how he preaches togetherness yeah. with his team, the bond that they have, the relationships. He talked to us about that. It's all about relationships and having the trust of the kids. Another bad snap, and Lizer has to fall on that. To, to speak to your point, we're talking about Devin Carter and how he has bought into Coach Jinks' system. And Coach Jinks told us that as soon as he got the job, one of the first things he did was he and Carter went out to lunch just to get to know each other, to try to build that relationship. 